Hey, it's Noel Christopher with Renner's Warehouse. Quick video here. I was at the IMN conference last week and it was a great conference. Uh, you know, it's, it's amazing to see how the industry is changing as far as the single family rental industry and the built to rent or build for rent BFR is blowing up right now. And it's really where a lot of, uh, a lot of the investors are going because there's a ton of opportunities there. And we just found a huge demand for companies and firms that need uh, the benefit of our boots on the ground to help sell uh, single-family rental portfolios and homes in general so you know it's great because we have our boots on the ground in each market that can sell single assets we have a portfolio services team which is something I'm, I'm a big part of that can sell uh, large portfolios and we happen to have a lot of buyers that also want to buy and so we're starting to hit that critical mass and it's great and so we're looking for more portfolios we're looking for more opportunities and uh, the conference was great another thing that happened today is a core logic came out with their report and uh, so for all of you that have uh, been predicting or all of those have been predicting the uh, demise of the housing market it's just not here yet it's not happening and yet I guess is the operative word but um, you know the prediction is or the last year prices um, have appreciated about 3.6 percent the next year they're they're looking at it's going to go up about 4.7 percent that's still above historical trends uh, there's some markets that are overvalued somewhere around 37 percent of the top 100 markets are overvalued but 26% uh, are undervalued and another 37% are at value. So the way we look at it is that you can look at it and say you have all these overvalued market, great. Uh, if you're investing, maybe those aren't the markets for you. Maybe there's still good investments because of uh, the rent increases and things like that. So it all depends on how you look at the numbers. If you're looking at the number as a pure house price number, or if you're looking at the number for, for a return. And the fact that you have 26% of the top 100 markets are undervalued, those are amazing markets to invest in. And we're seeing that in a lot of these second, uh, what we call second tier tertiary markets, but there's still a top 100 market. Um, there's investors that are starting to see a lot of interest in those markets because they're, they're not able to get that 6%, 7% yield that they would like to get in these in these some of these overvalued markets so they're going to these smaller markets we're looking at some markets like Little Rock Arkansas Tallahassee uh, Columbus Ohio um, Oklahoma City Tulsa Huntsville a lot of these great markets that have a lot of opportunities or a little bit lower cost markets but there's still a lot of demand for rentals so uh, leave a comment below I look forward to hearing from you and I'll talk to you later thanks